Okay, good, we are live. Eh, uh, hello! So we are... <laughs> Wait, hold on. Error? No. Yeah, okay. Twitch, I know you were trying to gaslight me into thinking bad things were happening. When they weren't! <laughs> yeah, dick. Anyway, hi! Uh, so he, we are back at it again with Little Nightmares 2 ready to carry on. Um, I'm probably gonna fumble around and make more mistakes, so uh, fucking embrace yourselves. So last time got through the forest area, there was a bit of try and error, and then we got to the school where there was violence to be had. I, I hate these, like, wee rascals. Um, but yeah, I am uh, ready to make progress. Also, so... For the... right, hold on, I need to... Now, I should mention, uh... I had a friend that knows Little Nightmares too, and they did, uh... Give him a little hand for being stumped at this bit. Because they gave me the heads up that what I was doing, right, because I was confused last time, I'm like, okay, I can't bring the ladle through to the next area, and if I try to run, I die. So what we do is apparently we can just put this kid's head on and uh, this is how we go through, you know, it's a disguise, which I uh, the thought that I could put on the decapitated head never even crossed my mind, but it's like, okay, you know, enemies and little nightmares have put the mask. Oh my god, these wings are actually mental. And yes, we... Ooh, asshole, right? But, uh... I guess we totally don't stick out at all with, like, the... clutching and holding. Yeah, okay, the disguise was definitely needed, because... God, could you imagine if I'd actually tried to run through this? Well, no, because I would have died easily. Hey, we're not going to stick out if we try crawling under the table. Of course not. Oh, oh these wings are... main oh, They kind of make sense. Oh, you little bastard, how really little far is this set in the back? Do I need to go do... Okay, no way. Get it saved from, uh... Here, right, okay. Let me hurry up. But yeah, this was like the only heads up that I did get, so don't worry if people are wondering, they're like, oh, has friend assisted me and helped me with so much more stuff. Nah, that that, that was literally my heads up they gave me, which is good because my dumbass would not have figured that out myself. Uh, okay, I can get in there and do that. And then, uh, just squeeze by. Oh yeah, I guess the one other thing they did tell me is like, in case it interested me for factual cases that the, the character we play as his name is a uh, Mono, Mo apparently, so it's like, okay, you know, it's Mono, I guess, I, you know, but you're still going to be like a little violent face to me. Oh, yeah, I, I see you swinging around doing that, that's a hazard. God, I don't want to do something some sort of old ass spin, but that's a hazard, you should be doing that youngin. Dangerous? No, it's dangerous, you're gonna get me killed by that shit. Can I just, uh... Go far... No, I can't go far into the background. The foreground, maybe? Oh, this is a... Then I don't know, uh, yeah. I'm watching because I know that's gonna kill me, I'm sure. I don't trust it, I literally don't trust anything in this God Forsaken building. And that door is shut. Can we like gently nudge it open? No. Eh. Uh, 
Hmm. We can't even jump either. Okay, so I got to go around you. I'm still watching out for you, dumb lump kid. See, I see a rope, but uh. Well, we can't exactly go and pull that right now. Do we need, maybe we need to like... I don't know, let's go under the light and trigger the trap then. Maybe that'll do something. No, does it not? Hmm. I really like seeing some of the bodies and it's like, oh yeah, some people are just straight up dead. Can we nudge this door open? No. Hmm, what do, what do? I didn't miss anything back here, did I? No, because that just goes back into the hole. Yeah, no, going back there. Um. Yeah, I've got to make sure I'm not looking over something obvious again. Because God forbid to do that. Right, so we definitely can't push, we can't jump. Uh, do we have to like trigger somebody? Okay, no, we don't even. I, I don't even know what I was thinking there. I was thinking if I like interrupted the game of jump rope, if I would start a riot or something. Dumb thinking, but you never know, especially with all these mental wings. Like, eh. Uh, see, it's the fact that ropes there, it's like we could do something with it. Actually, hold on, is this like a wee crawl space? Hey, There we go, I was just being blind. Now that's an easy thing to overcome, and their disguise is going cool. Uh, I know if to hit that bill, but I'm just checking for like hiding spots. There actually, is there anything up there? In fact, is there anything down here? Because I'm going to need... Oh, can I maybe throw like the shattered pieces in my disguise? No, no, okay, they're not significant enough to pick up, fair enough. Uh, oh, we're strong enough to lift this up, okay. Come on. Well, f fuck, what you mean, it's a one and done in this case. Uh, you have failed with me, Jor. Ay, 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 right. I guess I'll just do some platforming for the time being while I figure stuff out. Oh well, I'm not even getting to use that jar. Uh, oh, careful now. Yeah, we're gonna need to pick up a little bit more speed. And also, hey, climbing is actually cooperating today. Oh, right, I see what the game wants us to do. Oh, this is a a real little bit of platforming. Okay, I see you. Yeah. Been looking for some of this. Uh... I'm not gonna break all the jars, even though it'd be funny to do so, because uh, you never know when I might need. Oh, what's this, like a brain in a jar? Uh. Well, that'll be here yeah, handy down here. Um, that looks grabbable, right? Yeah, and you're gonna take me down. Nice, thank you. Right, now where'd that brain go? Eh, uh, cause you won't be a one and done thing. Thank you. Oh, fuck you again. Oh, getting the frogs for funny dissection class. Oh, those wee bastards are actually going to love dissecting, aren't they? That's going to be a riot, I'm sure. Right, yes, I get it. The jar is very great. You want to admire it. You want to be like, ooh, yes, the jar. Um, but you want to, like, I don't know, carry it off somewhere. 
Because I hate that I can't even see exactly where I am. Uh. See, I don't know why would you put the crawl hole there if I'm not to, you know, use it. Because if I just go to. Oh wait, hold on. Am I inside the cupboard? No, I'm not inside the cupboard. Straight. Uh, Uh, well, that's GG's. Uh, see, I don't know, because I guess I'm... Because I was trying to think where to go, and it's like probably not to the foreground to walk by. Because I'll just get caught, and it's like, you know, there's three hiding zones here, so I'm guessing they, they're intending for this to be like a set piece where I use them all. Because I have noticed that with the stealth sections in this game, is it's very, um... Especially compared to the first game, it feels very, um, like, set piecey. like, okay, we want you to do this specific thing. When, uh, in the first game, from what I remember, uh, like, you would have more, uh, sporadic interactions with, like, the... Especially when I think about, like, the chefs, like, that felt, like, very sporadic, like, you just kind of had to wing it. I mean, I guess the long arm did the the, the janitor was kind of like that as well. You know, th there were definitely some like scripted, or you know, s moments where you had to do like a specific thing. Right, game. What's the problem here? Why are you not letting me through the door? Oh, right, we had to be... Ah, door, don't... Automatically oh, shut on me. Wait, no, that's a... Just a way that I've come to feel about this game. And it's not... A bad thing, per se. You know, it's definitely a... Like, a slightly different approach, because obviously, you know, it's still a... Uh... Right, come on, push! Come on, get in there. Right, let me get under the table. But yeah, it's... Uh, I, I don't know. That, that's just a, <coughs> an observation I've made with the game. At least so far. Um, of how it wants me to... Go about doing things. Actually, hold on. No, I don't think they want me to do this. Because I'm not going to be able to see shit. I think I know what they want. Because there's a lot of stuff on that worktop and the, these handles look claimable. But don't push that. I'm, I'm pushing my crawl button. Yeah, see as I approach she just conveniently turns away. Two seconds and she heard me. Oh, jeez. Oh, well, I guess that just teaches me got to have the the patience for the stealth section. The old ones also crouch. Because it was the thing I was noticing is my uh, L2 button seems to have this weird habit of um, 
for whatever reason it seems to be counting as up as well as the crouch button. And uh, that's a little bit inconvenient, but if L1's also crouched, that's good. Just watching your pattern here, what are you doing? Going around checking cupboards, I assume. And somehow you didn't hear me jump. Oh! Oh no! <laughs> right, okay, I've got mm, the pattern mostly down. I don't know. I, I I wonder if like they really wanted to get in with the uh, try and error vibe of this game compared to the first one, considering um like the love for traps and how scripted some of the sequences. Well, I I don't know if I can go on about scripted sequences because it's not like you need to fail in these parts to succeed. Um, it's just be stealthy, I guess. Although the trap is um. I don't know. It was fine in the forest, but the school definitely loves them. And it's like, yeah, you feel you would kind of need the, the trial and error for that. Or at least that's how I feel about it. I don't know. That's just my wacky opinion. You know, fuck it, I'm going for it. Oh, God. Clyde? Oh, yeah, I'm fucked. I'm no way running that. Um, do I have time to hide like under the chair or something? I wonder. gonna move so I can go up. <laughs> oh, of course you turn down right in there and you're gonna catch me through the gap. Okay, good to know. I don't know if I have to accept getting caught with that last stretch or if I have to just not get seen. I, I, f I feel with the big leaf effect that it then just going to hear me at least. But then it's trying to figure out do I have time to climb and run or do I need to hide? Yeah, I'm going to let you turn around. You know, it's been a while since we've been travelling this school. I will still ponder where our companion is and if they're dead or not. Because I'm certainly about to be dead. Yeah, I can go under that bench there if I run into the background, but I don't know if that's what I'm supposed to do. Maybe I should actually get by this area first, then I can ponder <laughs> what to do in the next bit. Well, I say that, but to be fair, um, I do kind of go out fast once again to that room. Right. You turn around, you're gonna move there. You didn't see me! You're gonna draw your circle and then go on, do your cover check. sure you'll look round soon. 
Yeah, you're gonna do your return. I'm not sure if they should hear me or not, but I'm gonna just play it safe this go about. Okay, now nah, I think I'm good. I think I've actually done it. No, we don't go feeling the walls, get in there. And... Oof, that's a stumble. Oh, hold on, is this another motherfucking hammer? Oh yeah, more violence time. Oh god, I thought I was fucked there. Oh, I might just be fucked. Um, oh, that shot behind me. Right, um... Right, so I think I need to let... The bucket kill the kid? And then I get out of the way, pick up the hammer, whiff, die anyway. Okay, I have enough time to pick up the hammer after the bucket swing, that's good though. Hey, bucket, you kinda missed your fucking cue. I say that, I think I, think I didn't go far enough to... Oh, well. Oh, it can swing back and hit that kid, hey, that should, eh... Uh... Oh man, I need to... <laughs> I, 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 I love that he just keeps running into it and getting killed, but I have to, like... ...not get killed myself. Oh, you bitch, I thought you'd stop a little closer to me. Eh, uh, nuisance. I didn't pick that up in time. Why? Okay, I... Nope. Oh, God. I think I need to do something similar to like what I did last time. Where once I have the hammer I need to start like waddling up to the kids. Because that way I can like close the gap when they go to do their like pause before the lunge. Yeah, okay, that's the strategy. So I want to be careful for another trap. Is there one here? Okay, no, I'm fine. Let me get me hammer. I don't know if I should be carrying the hammer or if I should be prepared to... Oh wait, can I run with the hammer? Yeah, because I can see a wall. Why did I... I meant to stop running and I also stopped carrying the hammer. That was dumb of me, but okay, they're... Generous with the safe state. Surprised that these lockers try to like fall on you. Oh wow, I just didn't shoot real bad, but okay, I can see there's a wee bastard that tries to come up behind us. So I know the pattern for dealing with the first two if I can play neutral, right? Oh no! What am I doing? I'm so bad at game.
Oh, why are you just out of my reach? Ugh, I hate you. Mm. And you just decide not to do your one generation. Did I get too close? Ugh. What the fuck is this neutral shit? We hammer means don't do this. We're good brain dead folk, don't you know? Monster Hunter and God Eater understood this. Well, I got a little nightmare, so okay, I understand it's not that kind of game. Before anyone takes that, like, joke line of being serious. Like, why do I never just be in range for you? Just that one week, kid, I'm gonna feel so good. When I, like, smash his head in with hammer. <laughs> And I'm just thinking of like that one, you know, afterlife clip just because of it. I just threatened a ten year old with a hammer. That's me. Right, who's fucking next? Oh, someone thinks they're slick. Oh, someone is slick! And. Oh shit, he, he actually, uh, he went for the punish, he plays neutral good, oh, holy shit. Now, that's what I get for being a bit too jumpy and triggered happy, I gotta actually learn this neutral shit. got you and then you think you have an open and you were right because I haven't been too button happy and after I'm done with Little Nightmares so I need to treat myself to a funny Monster Hunter session it'll be like man children annoy me I'm gonna beat up a regime or something Oh shit, I actually thought I had my time bad, but just straight. Then hope. Yeah, put the hammer down because I think that's a. Uh... Okay, no, we'll carry the hammer again. Now, this one up ahead is definitely a trap, I'm sure. Yeah, you gave me a safe state right here as well, so, uh. Yeah. Had a fucking hunch. I wonder if this is just a thing with the school or if like every area from here on out is gonna be this trap happy. Oh wait, hold on, is that fucking companion hung upside down? Oh <laughs> I finally found you, don't fucking worry about it. You should actually worry about it. <laughs> I'm bad at neutral. <laughs> Alright, this time for real though. Yes! You see, companion, we do a little bit of the. Hold on, let's. Let, let me get you down. This might be a bit rough. Please tell me I didn't kill you. I was prepared for you to die, but I don't want to be the cause of it. Hey, oh, get up, Tripper. <laughs> we got Egypt's to slay. <laughs> Right. 
Portuguese uh, reunited, we might as well put our power sticker to open this window. Oh, I, I, I suck at going through this window. Fucking kids thought they had us beat. We, we killed a guy with a gun. Eh. I don't like the fact that it's specifically a piano. It's like, yeah, we're gonna climb up. But this is gonna... Trigger a chase me things. Oh wait, no, hold on. Never mind. I'm dumb. I'm not seeing the vision. No game, we're doing the thing right. Let's just keep going. Right, so we're lifting up a piano. What's the goal? gonna break through with s more synchronized jump. <laughs> oh. oh, I'm surprised that didn't get any unwanted attention. Yeah, well, I think I see where we have to go now. Right, hoist them up. specifically have the key, but where's a weapon when you really need one? Oh, I see we're doing a sneaky. Good, you keep on being a distraction and I'm just gonna... Wait, ain't this the key here? Or do they still have it on them when I need to... Is this not a weapon I can pick up? I thought it would have been... Is this not the key I can pick up? Oh no, that's just your leg, I'm sure. Oh wait, no! Thank you, I am sorry companion, you gotta keep being the distraction. Uh... Is there a weapon I can pick up? Surprise. Right, sorry for the wait, friend. Let us get this open because I cannot jump back through that gate. What a fun little set piece. God, am I gonna have to like worry about protecting me and friend all now? Hey, you're getting awfully close to that gremlin child. What are you playing at? Or are you telling me you've secretly become a fighter? <gasps> you have? Yo! 
companion has hands. Look at you. Uh, I'm so pr I'm so proud of my little assistant. They grow up so fast. <laughs> Fucking, I've raised this child. <laughs> Man, I'm telling you, the, 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 the wee fellas, the little kids in Little Nightmares, they do not play. You know, first we had six, becoming all devouring being, you know, Mono kind of got hands, ready to spill blood, and now companion is as well. You know what, now that we're together, com to companion, we should, uh, cook up a plan to kill the teacher. You know, I'll lure her out, she stretches her neck, and then you're just like, Oh, grab that shit, give her a good strangling. And I believe you can do it. I mean, hell, you killed that kid with your bare hands, that's the shit I wish Mono could do. I'm gonna play as that kid. You know, throw some hands. But I can push this, but I don't know what point that serves. Oh, let's see, climb up to help me. Right, I see. But man, I'm so pleased with the companion character. I need to ask my friend what they're called, if they've got a name. Oh, and of course, you heard just playing fuck ass piano. But hey, immediately I noticed this platform up here. Oh, you, you want to do a little performance of your piano? We're about to bring down the curtains. <laughs> And I see a crane that looks like it's attached. Right, good, they were playing piano, they heard nothing. Now, I'm gonna trust you're not gonna turn around at all during your performance. Just not going to move while you're not playing. Because I'm guessing that's the th thing that you'll hear me if I'm moving around while she's not playing. And then uh, we're going to wait till your next break. I see what I have to do, I have to go back across now and help her uh, bring it down. Good, add a bit more of a personal touch to it. I should have enough time to meet. Oh dear. Hmm. Oh god, kind of close there. Is there a way for me to climb up there? 
Oh wait, I see a hatch. There are we just going by? Was I wrong? We're not getting to do the kill. Ugh. Oh, well, don't that fucking suck. Oh, so I've not been. The yeah, wait till our next pause and then I'll try jumping up again. See the stuff in the f uh, well, background there, um, but I don't know if I'm expected to go up with that because I don't think so. I think surely I should be able to grab these books. Oh well, maybe not. Yeah, I'm no jumping up that game just saying no. Well, fuck. Now I'm dead. Don't do anything with that. Wait, I think I see what I might need to do actually. I think right, and then go. Oh wait, hold the fuck on, I just realized it's undone me lowering the platform. Well fuck me. You know, yeah, 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 Wait till the next pause and then I will start cranking that shit. Oh fuck, I did it too early. Yeah, I gotta just accept my demise at that point. Oh, f what a fucking thing, yes, Sam. Right, let's board the platform first and then we'll do our.
Well, them does seem to be somewhat generous. Okay, yeah, push this away because I don't want to get too close to her. It's steer. Yeah, I don't like that distance, because if you have a big jump, it might catch your attention. Do I have time to make that climb? I don't know. No, I don't. Hold on. <laughs> yeah, she's just had to notice me and I thought I was getting away with that. Am I going to have to do that all again? Oh, duh. Oh, because fucking wackadoo the last year can make one jump. No game. Come on. do this properly but now I'm like oh I'm sad I'm gonna rush this a smidge I probably shouldn't right, now I've got to deal with this weird ass thing to steer oh no don't you I don't want that bumping into the chair. You know, hold on, yeah, we can do it like this actually. And then I'll wait for the next pause here. Position myself right, wait for the pause. No, hold on, companion, we're waiting for that next pause. Right. Your tape. Oh god. What do you mean my face can squeeze through this vein? Oh god, climb? Yeah, thank goodness we're in a good climbing mood today. No, no, no. Oh, too close for comfort, and that didn't even kill you. So, she don't die, unfortunately. We, we just escape. Okay, fair enough. I guess we can't spill it all with the blood. Well, oh boy, wasn't that doozy.
Here you want the, the hand holding? Alright, why not? You've earned it. You've had a rough companion. And hey, these hands spell blood. Why not? I'll fucking hold that. Apparently I'm not allowed to hold your hand here. Oh, big ass trench. What is happening? Oh, that's right. Back to like rapture stuff with like the clothes of no bodies. There do be something going on here, but I'm not quite... I ain't quite pieced it together yet. Because it's not like everyone's gone because the teacher was there, there was those kids. Hmm. Oh, I've got to do a little balance now, okay. Oh wait, no we don't, we can just uh... Apologies companion, I can't platform. I... you'd think I'd be able to... Unless that's not what they want me to do. Hmm. <laughs> no, surely... Oh wait, hold on, is that really an RV to... Yeah, okay, I've learned my lesson from the last time. We can move big objects. Can we move the TV? No, we're just gonna... This would be so much easier if they can just let me up here, but okay. Okay, so that definitely can't be moved any closer. See, I, I don't know, because I see he's got a wee balancing animation, so... I, I presume I have to... Like, come on, game. Why the fuck can I not just go up there and get my stable footing? You know, like, what's that about? Unless I'm doing something wrong, because I don't think campaign's supposed to be left behind. Like, are you here because we need to like play the TV? I'll check again, but we definitely can push it. Yeah, no, the TV stays like that, so that's definitely not the problem. I think here I can push or pull it into that with to make life easier. Hmm. Well, here I'm getting stumped by something else. Some right, I need to, like, check if I just push, like, or two. Yeah, you just go up and then fall off it. I 
Unless, hold on, I were to maybe... Like, hang on from the other edge and then... Right, no, go on up. But, uh, so I can't just, like, leap off it. Different lot on the light, we can move this rope and move it. Wait, hold on. Because we can go up that rock. Alright, oh, I thought. Yeah, hold on. Because we can grab onto that. Okay, so yeah, I don't think balancing is like an intended mechanic. See, Logoro. Ah, hello, welcome to the chat. Uh, yeah, I'm trying to like figure out exactly what the games want me know from here. Because I thought we were just to move to this platform, but it's like, okay, apparently this isn't allowed. And it's like, eh, I might be missing something on obvious platform section. Because <laughs> this might have happened earlier in the game where it's like, I overlooked something completely, uh, <laughs> obvious. Push the bin to close the lid. Oh! Right, hold on, I see. Right, hold on, I need to grab a hold of it. Yeah, to close the lid, so hold on, do I need to move it back and then push it forward? Yeah, oh, I see. Oh, thank you, you have saved myself and chat so much time. <laughs> Honestly, savior of the stream, thank you for that. Man, that is... Like, that makes sense, but god, that's... You actually gotta be paying attention to the environment for that one. Oh my god, thank you. <laughs> oh, that's game, man. Like, it is getting me to think in ways that I do not think. Then, then again, it's like, um, Ongo Bongo Man playing a game with pauses in it, maybe I should avoid it. It's a bit different. You know what, thank you for saying that, now I'm gonna feel less bad. Definitely not as bad as uh, some of the other weed goof ups have had. True cup. Oh, hold on. So, companion with six all along, that, I, I guess that explains the bloodthirst, um, I mean, not to assume that every kid that puts on a raincoat is six, but if you say there's a trophy called True Colors attached, I kinda have to, so we aren't, if you ever get stuck again or want a hint, just ask. I don't want to spoil anything for you. Ah, I will do. Thank you. And also, I do appreciate that the give hint when asked uh, without spoiling. That is very respectable and appreciated. I should mention, just because I've been doing this like the last few minutes, that I've been asking like questions out loud of... Uh, Lower implications. If I have something like that, that's me just talking to myself. Um, unless I like reach. What are we doing here? Six, right? Holy stop, kill. Because yeah, until I reach the end of the game, I don't actually want any thing about the the story or lore. So if I say something like, "Hmm, I'm questioning the lore," um, that is me just talking to myself. But otherwise, I will be asking like a genuine question. Uh. 
because you know there's definitely some stuff going on in this game and y you know first little nightmare I had uh, you know sm oh wait I'm a dingus I need to help help you get in first right I know how hatches work I should know that by now but yeah first game had some interesting wee tidbits of lore and it's like there's something going on in Little Nightmares too, but I, I'm not quite far enough to have pieced it all together yet. But it's like, mm, all the clothes with no bodies, it's like, I don't know, I feel like we're going for like maybe like a Rapture reference or something here, but um... Oh boy, another big ominous building, eh, what have we got this time? Just making our way through the neighbourhood and getting ourselves terrorised at this point, honestly. Well, I can't wait for the third one It's going to happen. Oh, hold on, I never even, I didn't even know that there was a third one announced. Or that I had caught, and now I feel, I feel that's funny, because uh, during like, some of the interactions with this game I did make a small comment uh, I think it was last stream like oh what if Little Nightmares did the like co-op stuff with this shenanigan oh that's neat I'm interested about that now I might have to I might have to uh, find and abduct someone there's a trailer you know what after this stream I'm actually gonna check that out because I'm very interested And it's like, oh, now I've got something cooking in my head, because it's like, you know, with the funny timing, it's like, that's a... Wait, so wait, did Little... Wait, how long has Little Nightmares 3 had, like, a trailer? Is this, like, a recent thing that just got announced, or has this been, like, announced, like, a while ago? Because I did not hear a peep of it, and I am actually amazed. Oh, so if that's co-op, that's got my head spinning for a funny idea, because it's like, well, eh... Uh, it's gonna have gnomes, I'm guessing. Oh, yeah, the gnomes! That'd be funny. It's been recent... Right, ah, good, I'm not that out of the loop. Like, too much... Okay, that's... Okay, I'm not too out of the loop then, that's neat. Because now I've got the... What the hell is... This wack-ass platforming contraption, okay. But, uh, oh, oh yeah, now to actually go on with what I've been rambling on about my ideas, like, if it's got co-op, um, you know, my friend and fellow streamer, uh, Viticella, recently played the first Little Nightmares, and it's like, oh, she, she had a wacky time with the game, and it's like, mmm, with her stupidity combined, Little Nightmares 3, that, I'm gonna have to pester her about that for an idea. Cause god <laughs> If that's the thing that could happen that would be funny so well, obviously I, I ah! What the f <laughs> L little buddy heard my Oh I guess we just respawn here, okay. I was about to make the joke with little buddy heard my like dumbass joke of like combining stupid the thing was like nah, I'm giving up in the world. We don't wanna live in that timeline. <laughs> Now obviously that's just a wacky idea in my head, I should probably like put up the disclaimer like no that isn't like a conformed collab or anything, uh, but uh... Some people still run into bugs in the, the, this game, like if you do something that's unintended the NPC gets stuck or bosses when you were... You know, f ah, funny enough, um... I had wondered about that, cause I, there is like one or two spots where I've noticed things being like a wee bit odd or buggy, more so just in like uh, in control th stuff to like a minor extent. Although we did have one funny uh, uh, bu bug out um, in the last stream I did where we were being uh, chased by uh, the guy with the gun. Uh, oh, right, I wasn't supposed to do that. But yeah, we were getting just by the guy with the gun and uh, I died to him. And uh, we, we just had, like, an animation where both characters, like, just... Uh, both our characters just, like, flew up into the sky. 
It was it, it was weird, but it was a funny little thing. Give me a good laugh. Like that thing you picked up to put into the wall in one of the areas. It didn't show. Oh, actually, hold on. Speaking of, I should be picking that up again, shouldn't I? I'm I'm getting myself so distracted with wacky talk and forgetting to actually do the game properly. Mm, so the game be a bit buggy. That's interesting to know. I mean, overall, uh, I don't know. I've, I've had my ramblings of like my thought on the game so far, and it, you know, I do think Little Nightmares Two is good, but it's like uh, you know, one or two finicky moments, and I've noticed. I, I don't know. I was sharing my thought how I feel so far. The enemy interactions definitely feel like a lot more. Um, scripted than they were in the first game, which I don't think it was a bad thing. Oh no, Rex, we Okay, I accident. There are five chapters and I'm gonna guess this is the third. Also, that's actually good to know how Have you died a lot? Ah, uh, yeah, quite a bit. <laughs> um <laughs> I am um, not good at this game and I've had a lot of dumb deaths, especially in the school, because my blind ass uh, did not pay attention to the traps at first. And also there was stuff like, like badly time and uh, the, the hammer swings to kill the kids. <laughs> it took me a while to kind of get the timing down for that. So yeah, that is like one disclaimer I need to bring up is like, yeah, th th this is gonna be a playthrough like filled with a lot of deaths. <laughs> Cause good, I have no competency. If you don't die a lot, otherwise you're talking longer. Yeah. <laughs> when I feel bad for the, the stream chats, like apologies everyone, you could have been done with this game and two, maybe three sessions, but, uh... Ooh, yeah, uh... Oh, go, 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 go! <coughs> but yeah, I mean, so far, what I'm trying to think, because what last stream was, like, a little over two hours, like, two hours, ten minutes, so we are at... the three-hour mark of gameplay, and we're at the third chapter, so that... I, I, I don't know, I'm, I'm definitely not doing this within the four, four and a half hour mark, I think, but... Yeah, good job. I know, I, I did think, uh, now there's going to be much more death to come on. I don't like the wearing a flashlight section, it's like a... Friend? Oh yeah, uh, I kind of figured that out when they put on the ring quest. Like, this is a... Uh, six from the first game, I'm assuming. I mean, not to say that like all raincoat people are the same, but like this is a, uh, you know, a little bit of savagery. You know, they put on the raincoat. I'm like, yeah, this is this is our little nightmares one pro tag. Although that does have me questioning the thing that I'm trying to wonder is, because uh, I just automatically assumed this was a sequel. But I'm like, is this a prequel, maybe? Because I kind of just imagine she would be doing her soul-sucking shenanigans if that, that, that was the case. Or if it was a sequel. Yes, yeah, so that's six you're playing as a mono right now. Right, I see. Yes, because uh, b between streams, uh, a friend did tell me that uh, yeah, this character's name was Mono. I don't know if there's any significance to that. I don't know if like Mono had any connection to the first game. Well, I remember the six. Um, unless Mono was like DLC related, because I didn't play the first game's DLC. Does the story kind of start to piece together now? Um... No, quite... I, I, okay, right. 
I, I guess I could, like, attempt, like, dumb what Unleash Theorizing is so far. Right, so... Oh, see, it kind of depends if this is, like, a sequel or prequel. I'm going to assume that this is, like, a prequel to the first game. And this is, like, a connection to, like, how Six ended up in the place, like, the restaurant from the first game. Unless it's a sequel and all the... And all the, like, empty bodies in the clothes is, like, Six finished the first game. And she, like, ate the souls of everyone. And now she's just like, yeah, no, oops, went on a bit of a rampage. Did you enjoy fighting the long neck and our lady, she's creepy. I also dislike the roof guy, which is chapter two. This is chapter three, you're in. Um, oh yeah, so... Yeah, yeah, long neck lady would definitely had some, uh, like, creepy intense moments. Uh, especially, like, the... The the one bit that really stood out to me with her was the... Uh, bit where you're, like, climbing the pillars of books and you say, Oh, we've got another wacky, trippy TV. Um, but yeah, the books bit, where it's, like, the book tower of books and you have to go around the tower while she stretches her neck around. That was... God, that was probably like the highlight of like dealing with long neck lady that stood out. But yeah, definitely um, on the the creepy eerie end, especially out of, like enemies that I've seen in this game so far. Right, so we need to do the tuning. You can hold. Oh yeah, I do like that. Uh, you can hold Six's hand. Um, you know, it's like she needs a friend. Right, so I've just to like... Fit the, oh, hold on, there we go. No, I'm getting colder. Warmer. Oh, hold on. So about here. I'm back at the hole. That's right, because this hallway is reoccurring. And I'm guessing there's a connection to the first game, because, you know, the door has the eye mark that was everywhere in the first game. But the connection between this hallway that keeps appearing with Mono's TV ability, uh, in connection to the door of the eye, I'm not sure how that pieces together. But then again, this is chapter 3 out of 5, so I assume the later chapters are gonna maybe give more hint. Oh my, where the f Okay, so we go. Okay, so bodies are just decapitated. I mean, I know we've seen bodies and corpses, you know, especially with the first area. But it's like, man, they just took some limbs. Right, so we gotta go battery searching. That's a locked door. I can pull that to proceed in the elevator. Where? The part you're on is different. Oh, whoops, I slipped. Eh. <laughs> right, so this is a difficult part. Um. Oh boy, with how much I died in the school. Ooh, man. Right, anyway, if I could actually walk in not be like a drunk person, that would be a great start. I am someone to have faith in, clearly. Right, and you need the battery as well. Right, so the elevator it is. Oh boy. Uh, hey, Six, do you want to just, uh... You know, give the legs a yoink. Unless is the elevator not where I'm supposed to go? No. You got this? I certainly hope so. It's probably going to take me a few tries. Uh, 
I didn't over okay. Got a lot of blocked ways, but I got a like Figure it I've not overlooked anything. Unless I just need to be better at like yoinking a the lever. Did I overlook a I don't I think I would have saw if one of the batteries were in the bomb bit. Right, okay, I'm definitely not budging that lever, so um Oh wait, hold on, I can just go to the right instead of going upstairs. Absolute blind ass buffoon. Uh Oh, right, I've clocked it now. We're in, like, a hospital. Right, what have we got here? And also, there's more eye drawings here, so that's... <laughs> eye drawings that's got to be connected to the first game. Right, you're twitching. This part is tricky. Oh, boy. Eh... Uh... Oh, is this just carrying the You might need to. We will. I uh, probably will. Wait, wait hold on. What, we, what is six carrying there? Oh, it's a. Uh, oh, when do those monkey things? Okay. Um. See, I saw the bear twitching, and I thought, oh, is it electronic? Does it have a battery in it? But I think that's a no. Uh, can we open... I, I need to stop pushing X thinking that's like an extra budge button because it just makes me jump away. I don't know where I'm getting that muscle memory from. Right, um... Yeah. I tend to do what I, uh, <laughs> tend to do what I do and I don't know what to do, eh, uh, break shit. <laughs> then maybe the answer will be revealed to me. <laughs> maybe I'll break myself in the process. So outside that thing is an ace. <gasps> oh wait, hold on. Cause, eh... Uh, like I said, the, uh, I saw, well, hold on, because I saw the bear twitching, so I have to, like, see if there's, like, batteries inside the... Hold on! Yeah, I see a key in that monkey. Six, I know you like the toy, give it to me. Six, I require the monkey. Right. Uh. <laughs> yeah, using the X-ray to see what's inside. She won't give it to you. Her toy has nothing to do. Oh, right. So I have to focus on the other stuff for now. Right there. Surely... Aha! I see.
No, uh, I'm picking up the wrong bear. You. Right now, how. How do I tear open the toy? I got to think. There must be something around here that will let me rip this thing open. Because it's a teddy, so I can't exactly like smash it. Yeah, that's what I'm trying to figure out. Because it's a teddy, so I can't like throw it from a height. Or would that work? So I'm just like keeping an eye out. Like, there's got to be a sharp object somewhere. Or could this empty room maybe have something to do with it? You know, I've got to consider everything now that, uh... Oh, well, we're going on a lift to somewhere. Maybe a room with sharp objects? Look at his six with a couple of crazy kids with her funny toys. You're on the right... Yes! Hold on, what's this? Is that a... Little object with a hook. Oh, it is. Hold on. We're going from child behaviour to Scottish child behaviour. Time to play with sharp objects. <laughs> sure, you want to open this mono? Sure, I'm guessing. I don't know, maybe there'll be a body inside or something. I want to play with the sharp object. Give it to me. No, I'm uh, not allowed. Okay. Um. Okay. I I guess we don't do the. Is that not leading to anything? Um. Wait. What does this do? You know what that will do. Yeah, yo, yo, wacky kids like a little. Uh... Oh, I see you want to burn your toy as well. Great, burn the cars, eh? Yo, kids like uh, FNAF reference. You know, we do a we we do a little fire. That's it, yes, you murdered the teddy bear. Ah, uh, we're on a path of carnage. You know, we've killed the guy with the gun. We killed a bunch of kids in the school. The, the teddy bear was not to be spared. <laughs> Just because I'm playing a funny little puzzle horror game, I'll, I'll still do my Ungo Bunga shenanigans. I'll cause a path of carnage. <laughs> you know, uh, one... Could call Mono a uh, little nightmare. <laughs> I'm I'm unfunny. Uh, please, please, nobody laugh at that or find that amusing. <laughs> anyway, so moving on from terrible attempts at humour. <laughs> uh, now we can just uh, use the key. And also I'm a little afraid because it's like, yeah, solving puzzles in the hospital. Haven't seen the main threat yet in this area. And, uh, you know, we got chased by a guy for a gun. Okay, that was a little intimidating, you know. Long neck lady was kind of creepy, so. Where am I from? Uh, yeah, I'm from Scotland. Um, so yeah, if you're curious or wondering about the accent, that's probably it. Do not worry if that was a thing on your mind, uh, it's, I, I get it a lot, and I have no problem with it. Because <laughs> I, I got my wee bit of pride in my own accent in home country. Oh, how do you like it there? Uh, you, you know, I do actually... 
Yeah, yeah, I like my home country. I'd say, say it's good. Uh, we get, like, a lot of rain weather, and the sun is a foreign concept to us. But, uh, y- you know, you, you spend as long as I have in this country, you learn to get used to it. I, I can't handle heat at all, though. Couldn't you go to uh, some sun- sunny-ass country, like... I don't know, I, off the top of my head, I'm thinking of, like, places like... Florida or California, because I know friends there. You know, because there's friends like, well, well, one day at least it'll be cool for you to. But oh god, oh god, the arm moves. Um, I'm from Can. Eh, hey, respectable. I like that. It's kind of a weird random thing, but Canada's like one of those places where um, I've only known a handful of people that have went on holiday to Canada. Um, but every single person I know that's went to holiday on Canada has only had good things to say about it. Um, so I don't know, it's like, that that is like Scottish people's opinion, you know. I'm kind of fucking freaking out here with this area that bad things are gonna happen. I'm gonna get attacked by disembodied body parts. But yeah, Canada is great. <laughs> you know, my fear aside, um, you know, only heard great things about it, and it's like, eh, nice. Also, to be honest, I hear it's a cold country, so it's like, yeah, if I have to go on a holiday place, uh, nice place and peaceful country. Yeah, yeah, no, 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 no. Many people. Yeah, that is like one of the things I hear is like, oh, all the people in Canada are just like. Really nice, great place to be. Scotland, we uh, yeah, we we don't have the the reputation for niceness. Oh, get yourself up, Mono. Oh, no. okay. So disembodied body parts. That's the threat. I can see where the and and they're very fast. I can see where the problem and difficulty comes in for this chapter. Oh, I fucked up the slide. Ah, but you fucked up grabbing me. Uh huh. Oh, look at us, we're both failures. How am I fucking up the slide? Okay. Once, maybe. Twice. Mmm. I, I, I don't even know. Mono was having a stroke of which direction he wanted to go, apparently. This part is hard. Ah, <laughs> uh, right. <laughs> uh, oh, oh boy, we'll win. <laughs> well, you know what? Uh, if my death can bring some entertainment, the content will, it'll be good for when I do the video highlight edits. And now, if sliding would just cooperate with me here. You know, I think I need to be more in the foreground. Um, although it's like, God, I don't... I mentioned like video. Oh wait, ah, uh, so I can't even go under that table. Right, so I need to go over it and I need to climb quickly. Right, I see. Um, jumping on top. Yeah, I tried jumping up and pulling myself up but the hand caught me like once so I threw the idea out the window. Oh, why didn't you climb game? Please don't find climbing difficult. I, I really need to be on my A-game here because that hand is fast. Whoa, why did we jump off? Um, oh, God, right. Oh boy, this game. <laughs> And this is why I have my uh, split opinions. I don't want to say it like that because, you know, it's not that divisive. But I'm mostly enjoying Little Nightmares 2 so far, but, uh... Right, grab, climb. No, 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 climb up. But, I mean, the hand didn't kill me, so I guess I can be happy. Um, <gasps> what do you mean it climbs after me? Oh, oh no, 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 no. Oh 
my f oh no <laughs> why is it so small it's just a decapitated hand <laughs> oh man I'm not gonna like this area at all this is some freaky shit <laughs> I should have known this wasn't going to be fun at all. <laughs> it's like, you know, I think about, uh, you know, because when I think of like horror games in hospital, you know, there's like the first Silent Hill comes to mind, you know, Persona Q had a hospital area that was horror themed and made me shit my so violently. These are never good times. Like oh dear God, I'm 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 feeling the terror. I'm feeling the spook. Uh, yeah, October gaming. Yeah, the spooky vibes have arrived. And that was just like the first encounter. Uh, there's gonna be a lot more of that. I don't like that. Some dust fell off the roof. That hand's still haunting me, isn't it? It's gonna like drop down from the ceiling, and it is going to. I fucking hear it. I can fucking hear it rummaging around. Oh, there you are. Fucking knew you were cooking something. I hope I do. <laughs> oh, man. Horror game is actually delivering horror. Is it bad to say I'm kind of surprised? Like, I was expecting, you know, a, a, a bit of puzzle, a bit of, like, ooh, tense moments, like, long neck, um... Th this is, a uh, Yeah, that... that <laughs> right, da uh, Maybe I have to pivot? Oh, yeah, because that table... Mono, why did you stop? We were gonna run around in a circle. Because I see that table and it's like, yeah, that table to the left. I can climb that. Yeah, I'm just gonna run. Oh, I missed the table completely. Uh, okay. For some reason, Wano is struggling to run up, but to be honest, uh, I don't know, is that like... Hold on, I want to check my control quickly. So down, left. Because I do know this game gets a lot of floaty with its controls, but it's like... Hmm. Here's what we'll do. We'll start in the, f the background. So that when I have to pivot it, I'll run down instead. That will ease my paranoia. That hand is the day. Oh, it actually is. Like, see both like in actual gameplay and emotionally. Like, I, I really got a hand to it. It's kicking my ass and fucking delivering the spooks. Yeah, I'm gonna. Are you telling me I can't go along the shelves? I need to go back down? Mm. <laughs> I don't know why it's being dumb and went off there, but... Uh... Oh, it's not being dumb anymore! Oh, no, 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 no! <gasps> Hammer! Oh, what? Yeah, thank you, Monster Hunter. You were always by my side. <laughs> You, you know how to dodge. I hate you. I hate you. I hate you. Oh, there's multiple of you little bastards, aren't there? Actually, are there more or is this just like the one hand? Oh, fucking hammer, my best friend. You're always there for me. <laughs> 
<laughs> Whether it's a big angry gorilla or a hand of death. Oh. <laughs> Oh, now we just get a fun time with smashing the door. You know, I need some stress relief right now. I am filled with anxiety and I'm... Oh wait, go back. Did I miss something important? Oh, the battery! Oh! So... Yeah, you are actually being a lifesaver, because I would have went ahead without that, without you, because... Fear... Makes a guy blind. Right, pick it up, Mono. Hi, Six, are you having a good time? Yeah, you vibe, you vibe, kid. I'm, I'm, I'm just sad. I don't want to... I don't want to see another arm for a, a, as long as I live. Which is kind of hard, because uh, I look down and it's like, hey, what am I using to hold this PlayStation 4 controller right now? Fucking terrified. <laughs> oh boy. See, now I'm just thinking because, you know, dumbass content creator brain is like, well, at least I'll be able to laugh at this uh, in the future when I edit this for funny YouTube highlight video and now I'm just thinking, oh god, the highlight video. Because <laughs> my backlog is built up and I'm not sure what to do. Though I have been thinking about, um... Hold on, do I need to... No wait, because if I go back and pull the battery out, is that not just going to shut that door? Or does that door stay open? Hold on. Okay, yeah, no, um, no, being smart, that battery has to stay in there, we'll be pulling that out at a later date. Hey, right, I'm not being chased to death by hand, I can ponder, yeah, oh, yep, yeah, I'm, I'm getting hoisted. So, six can be safe and I can go back into the fray. Ah, thank you for the follow, Zelo girl. I I'm glad my w wacky antics you're having <laughs> been followed. They're like, yeah, that, that this is a guy. This is a guy worth watching. He dies horribly in it. For <gasps> no. Hey, you. Oh, does the light make you stop? Oh, that's the... Yeah, okay, this is the fucking game we're playing, is it? Is it? This little horror staple? I'm, I'm fucking... Hey, no, 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 don't do that. Don't touch me. <laughs> oh, God. I fucking knew not to trust it. I saw the body, I saw the, the limbs. I'm like, something's coming to get me. Use art. Oh, we can aim the flashlight. That's gonna make my life infinitely better. See, now I can do a little bit of trolling. Yeah, I'm fucking smooth. I'm, <laughs> I'm confident. Let's see how long it lasts. Because something's gonna actual fucking jump my ass in this. Hey, hey, there's a light here. I'm safe for now, don't kill me.
Oh, and you've just got bodies scattered about. What is safe? What's gonna get me? See my bon see my fumbling action strike. It, it, sometimes. So when horror games want to play in your paranoia, guess what? <laughs> individual gets fucked over. It's me. I'm the individual that gets fucked over. I'm going to become a mentally unstable wreck. This part is tricky. Most get stuck here too. Oh man, so I get to have mass anxiety and be stuck here? <laughs> Oh, do I have beers in the fridge? I could go for beer in the fridge. But I learned from my friend Vitty that drinking and little nightmares is a bad combination, but I do not give a fuck right now. Oh, and more bodies. Thank you, little nightmares. I... Mm, one of these has to... Be, Hi, Ska! Hi! <laughs> You're just in time to s No, 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 no! Back! Back, I see- Yeah, so Ska, you're, you're just in time to see me, um, have an actual mental breakdown, because I've been playing funny horror game that I thought was fun, um, but it's actually scaring me a bit, rattling me, somewhat good. So uh, if you ever wanted to see your old pal unleashed become a little bitch, um, yeah, get, get, yeah. <laughs> da, 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 back shuffle. Oh, so they're mannequins. They're not like actual corpses. It doesn't make them any less terrifying, but like. At least I know what the you I need a friend. I, I say that uh, well it's like y you know, Scott, you are my friend and you're here to Scott, I need to y you know actually no, I'm not gonna be rude to new follower. <laughs> Scott Cielo, I need a friend I need to just like positive vibes. <laughs> They may be called corpses, they may be called the fucking reason I have a heart attack, I'll tell you something what. Oh, I hate this, I hate this! They're pincering me! Ah. <laughs> How am I supposed to think clearly? And get through the area when I'm actually being an emotional nervous wreck? Want a little tip for this first part? Uh, sure, I will take tip. There is two parts here. You know what, if you want to give me a tip for this part, uh, go ahead, because I only have two brain cells uh, at the best of times, and they don't work very well when I become afraid. See if I can lure them. No, because if I try and do the lure, I'm going to get caught in the narrow area. Um, I feel like I've fucked myself here, but... Yeah, if you can go up a bit... Yeah, I've got to be very careful with my flashlight here, but... Wait, hold on. Eh... Oh, hold on, I can't read comments right now. Oh, I'm going under this bed. This first part, don't pull out your flashlight, just run and get under the mattress. Don't stop, you can avoid- You know, I didn't even think about just bolting it. So, that counts as the first part, is after the mattress here the second part, I uh, presume then? I'm trying to suss out here who- what's- You were the fucker that grabbed me before so I know you're real. 
Tak faham dalam member yang baik See the worst part? Uh, yeah, okay, this is the second part Right, so this is where uh, The idiot tries to The harder part <laughs> Yay <clears throat> oh, oh god, why are they actually moving? Are they moving faster or are they always this fast? I don't know. Oh, so yeah, I'm seeing the uh, mannequinness of them now. Oh, what did I do? What did I do? Where did I go? Wait, the window. Oh, get up, get up, get up! <gasps> oh, right, there's a light up there. Oh, fucking horror game, man. Like, actual horror. Yeah, I'm gonna climb up on this and one of them's gonna come to life and try and get me. No? I'm actually safe for now. You got it safe. Is that the... Most get stuck there for a while? Well, I am weird like that, I guess. I can... I get through the area that's like... Generally easy. Well... I die a lot of easy area. Fumble around and then hard part I just... Hey, look! You know, sometimes fear and anxiety can... Help, I I'm not even gonna pretend to have an ego anymore. I can't. I'm, <laughs> I'm sorry, chat. I can't pretend to have confidence or an ego. It's gone. It has been stripped away. There is just a very sad, nervous wreck of a man before you. <laughs> I don't like this game. <laughs> the game's not funny anymore. Oh, oh no, oh no, oh no, 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 no. Oh no, the game is no longer fun. I mean, it is fun. I'm experiencing fear in a horror game, and that's what I expect, I guess. But, like... <laughs> then again, the, the ones that get stuck here are playing with mouse and keyboard, which it isn't meant for... Yeah, I'm on a, you know, funny controller life. Okay. You know, hold on, I need a... Quick improv yoga moment or some shit. I need. I just need to deep breath. <sighs> you know, cleanse the mind. Um, you know, get yeah, yeah. Deep breath. Deep breath, ska. <laughs> well, welcome to improv yoga with Unleashed. Um, is the Unga man being camphor wounds in his life? Yeah. You better fucking believe it. Right. Okay, one more set of deep breaths. Actually, come to think of it, I didn't even ask that myself. Have you been scared? It has been a hot minute. <sighs> okay. Game time. <laughs> I think I need to steer a bit. <laughs> Good, just good to hear. I'm, <laughs> I'm glad someone's been able to just chill. Oh, I'm just assuming the flashlight isn't doing the only thing favor wise here. This is just like a chase things. Oh, wait, no, it does do something because it stops this. The I was secretly a little bit smart the entire time. This one's I might as well take what freedom I had. Yeah! <clears throat> I forgot you would probably still be pursuing me. I have no brain at all, I was dumb. Is it bad that I'm just thinking in my mind, like, man, I could go for some employment right about now. Uh, it's like, uh... 
Why am I... Why do I have fleeting? Why am I being playing this terrifying ass stream? Vetty, help me. Give me another job to do. <laughs> I want it. I don't care what people say. Bottom allegations, in my ass. The fucking <laughs> Vice dungeon is much safer and happier than this fucking cursed ass place. <laughs> ah no. Okay, right. We can do this section if we try. I just got a. Huh, I actually. God, I never even knew that. I never knew you were one of the. What? Okay, Cali residents, so. So my fucking Cali friend list just <laughs> keeps going off. It's like, uh, what do you know? It was four people all along. I don't know what the fuck it is with me and people from Cali. We, we just get along, I guess. <laughs> yeah, no, because think about it, right? Because first there was CL, and then there was you. But obviously, I didn't know you were from Cali until like right this moment. Then there's Vitty. You know, and now there's a, uh, you know, Carmilla who have like befriended, had funny art talk with while getting the commission done. So it's like, I'm just. Ra you know, I think it's so weird and fucked to say that I think I'm. I think I'm like everywhere. I've got more friends in Cali than I do anywhere else in the world, including Homeland Scotland. And that's a weird fucking thought process to have. Now I could make a joke like, oh man, time to go to Cali, all my friends are there, but um... Yeah, I've heard about how hot Cali is, and Scottish people don't do heat, so uh... Yeah, we'll, we'll stick with the long term friend, the long term, well, duh, no shit, people are friendships are long term unless you dumb asshole. Long distance friendships, that's the word I was looking for. Anyway, so my gameplay is bad and my mental state is also bad. I hate that I'm looking at the timer and I'm like, oh good heavens, are we almost at the two hour mark? I need to... Yeah, hot weather is... Oh, yeah. And then there's going to be a guy here. Oh, it's two guys. They right, angle, angle the flashlight. I don't know, I'm kind of presuming I might need to kind of just bolt it after I go by these mattresses, because I think caution isn't doing me much favour. Oh, fuck, I've got to climb again. The mannequins don't know how to climb, do they? Please tell me they don't. I, I, I don't need that in my life. <gasps> you please be a light switch. <sighs> and a momentary respite. Is that the right word? I don't fucking know. Everyone, I don't know words anymore. Please forgive me. Um, how ironic, you know, the shower, the place where you would uh, hear most buttfuck jokes is the place I'm feeling less buttfucked right now. Dear God, uh, I'm going to be busy with the highlight video for this one. Uh, only so, uh, YouTube.com. <laughs> Please forgive the, the, the shameless plug, I need something right now to distract me from the fear. This is my terrible coping mechanism. Uh, I need to remember how to think about getting through areas again, how to use my brain. It's kind of just left me.
No, I don't. I don't think we would use soap to get by. Um, wait, it's literally a box, but I can't push it. Hmm. Early traffic. Everything is quite cool. Quite the roll of dice this year round. Is the combat system? It's a bit slacky. Everything. Yeah, trying to get the time down for the combat in this game. Oh, here's a pushable box. And where was it? So yeah, the combat in this game is definitely weird and finicky. Um, and it's like I kind of get it because it's new to the game. They didn't have this in Little Nightmares One. Um. Because it is definitely about like getting the, the timing down, or else you can get, you know, fucked. Uh, like I said, it took me a while to figure that out in the school area. But then again, it's a problem I've had with the Little Nightmare games in general, is the controls have always had a bit of a... Uh, Uh, it's always had like a weird kind of floaty feel to the game, and for the most part, it's fine. Yeah. Well, okay, to be fair, like, slacky. I think, like, every part that has a weapon is like that, because all the weapons have, like, a similar swing to them. But yeah, I could see why the hammer bit would stick out, because it's, uh,. Yeah, that gave me a tonal shift because I saw a hammer. And, you know, I'm a hammer main and, uh, you know, Monster Hunter and God Eater, so my neurons activated. But then it's like, oh, it's like weird. Do timing good or you die. And. No, don't get stuck. Box. Oh, please don't tell me I've just been pushing this box for nothing. No, I'm desperate. Can we... Oh, no. No, if you'll figure it out. Yeah, I don't know, because I thought the... But you don't need... Yeah, I figured that out the hard way, because... Invisible wall, um... Hmm. Can we pull the... Hold on, actually that was a pull animation. That's your cloak. Cloak. <laughs> right, okay, so I need to do some of the wheelchair. I can't pull it at the moment. Um. Wait, hold on. Uh... If we go, okay, no, the, the bathtub doesn't do anything, I don't think, no. Eh, uh, let's look around. Sink. Combat would be a nice add-in, but it may take away a bit of the survival horror aspect that it displays with its scenery. Ah, uh, I don't know, I think how... Because we had the combat scene earlier in the game, I think... The game's not too bad at when it chooses to use the the combat. Um, but yeah, um, I do kind of question if combat was necessary for Little Nightmares. Too, but you know, it's an experimental add-on, and I'm all for uh, games trying new things because it's not the combat's not awful. Like, it, it takes a while to get used to, and it's not my favourite thing, but it's not like... Oh, no, I think I just figured out what I have to do with the wheelchair, because there's a mannequin in it. I have an idea, but I'm not gonna... Yeah, I'm able to turn the lights so off. I'm not gonna like this, because I don't know what the game wants me to do. This one got thing out. Yeah, we've. I mean, we've seen that a lot earlier this stream. There's a lot of like you got to think outside the box moment. Yeah, I fucking knew it.
Oh no, you're gonna get in the way, son. You touch the little yeah, a wee bit. Oh, I gotta be quick here. Oh, this fucking gay. <laughs> no, no, okay, the game's fine and all. This fucking area, it's not good for my health. <laughs> And now we're going to be able to move the wheelchair us soon. Okay, that wasn't too terrible a puzzle to figure out. See, that's not like the bin where I had to just... Because it's like, yeah, that's a bit, you know, how would I assume to shut the lid? Like, that's some physics shit. Um, I like that puzzle that made, like... See, that's a puzzle that I feel makes, like... It's vague enough, but it also makes, like enough sense. Okay, that was some weird jump and cast platform and we're in a dark room again filled with funny body parts. But see, it makes you think. Yeah, I mean, okay, to be fair, it, you know, that's like the mark of any good puzzle game, I would think, is like making you have a wee thing. Consider it outside the box! <laughs> hey, is this game a box? Because I want to go fucking outside it and be free from fucking nasty ass surprises like that. If are you even. Yep, so. Yeah. Honestly, I should have saw it coming as well, but, um, I am blind and safe. Right, so the one with the teeth is just a red fucking heron. I was waiting for you to get your... <laughs> yeah, please... No, like, honestly, I am suffering here. I hate it. Please take enjoyment in my suffering, everyone, because, um, I need something good to come out of it. <laughs> Oh, there's so many of you as well. No, 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 no. Don't block me, don't block me, don't block me. Just a little guy just trying to do a little squeeze through. No, 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 no. Pillar, get the fuck out of my way. I need to see the threats. I need to see the threat. Oh, I'm liking it. That is what running like a bitch does to you. Um... What time are we at? Almost 10? Yeah. Because the family is about to head to bed, I cannot be doing with uh, screaming like a little bitch. <laughs> okay, I've got a new plan. And this is going to probably end horribly, but... Uh... Oh, no, 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 no. Mono, no, I'm giving you a seizure, but this is all for a good cause. Mono run! Eh uh -huh. I'm clever. And. Eh uh -huh. there's a light there. The game says you're legally not allowed to go past this point. <sighs> Hello, Six. Next time, I think I should hoist you over and you should see what's going on over here. It's funny. We're having a fun time, Six. <laughs> oh, I'm looking at the setup of this room and it's like we're about to have dark humour in coming, aren't we? You know what? I could do with some dark humour. Wait, is that a body on the chair? I can't... I don't know what's what anymore. Don't put the power out! <laughs> Hi chat, have I made it obvious that this area has turned me into a scared little bitch? <laughs> now, uh, Six, if you want to do something to get me the fuck out of here. Oh, 
I see what we need to do now, because now we can take this battery and another one when we get out. Oh boy, right. <laughs> Let's go six, I wonder what anxiety awaits us now. Oh, oh of course, apologies six, you've been missing out. <laughs> oh, is she gonna get the other battery? Hey, you know, I think it's cool that Six is doing something for me. If she would like to go into the dark rooms for me, you know, that would be... No, get the... <laughs> Fuck you, Six. I want to get the closer spot. I think I deserve it after what I've fucking been through. Let me tell you, Mono, absolute chat, she's faster than you. <laughs> Is it? Yes, yeah, it's the master of the is it? It's true. You know, it's like some even you've got some legs on you, you should put them to good fucking use. Save me running from my fucking life. Oh, and it's a dark hole, <laughs> Oh, well. It's quiet. There are doors at the side. What the fuck is that? Oh look, the bunch of mannequins and they're all not moving. They're fine. It's just a background prop. It's all as little nightmare two developers. Please believe us. It's just a little funny. We all know you love the darkness. <laughs> Uh, I love darkness in selective places. <laughs> Cause like, like uh, uh, you know, I can fill you in on uh, some funny background uh, about me Cielo Guru, so... Funny enough, I actually work as a video editor for a vampire VTuber. And it's like, you know, that's good times, you know, funny... <laughs> Six does not let you shine in that light. I don't give a fuck, this light is my friend, Six. You're gonna have to add that. <laughs> I, I, I should be nice to Six, but also, like... <gasps> oh, Six is actually being chat. Just trying to like hold back the danger. Oh, uh, oh fuck! I need to evade the hand and uh, and pull those boards off, don't I? Board that six was guarding. Okay. Um. But you know, like I was saying, it's like yeah, you know, work, work as a video editor for uh, yeah. But yeah, like I was saying, you know, I work as an editor for a vampire VTuber and, you know, there are some jokes that come with that. It's like, oh, <laughs> oh, that funny guy gets locked away in a dungeon made to work for or something like that. And it's like, you know what? I, I, I'd be okay with that compared to this clusterfuck. Oh, I hate it. I forgot you can dodge. Why does the hand know how to play neutral? <laughs> I don't even know how the fuck how to play neutral. Oh no, two at once? Oh no, I can see why this is a problematic part. And it all comes down to me. I'm, oh, I'm. Oh my god, this is. You know, if I wanted to get assaulted by hands, I would just slapped on some Super Smash Bros. Master Hand, Crazy Hand. Right, so we've got another combat section. Except this one offers me a fuck ton of anxiety. See, last time it was just assaulting children, and that's great. Kids aren't a threat. But, like... Oh, good, the hands are on the same side now. 
I was severely hoping I could get the two for one there. But life is not so kind. Right, we are approaching my, my deadline time for streaming here, so I am going to give this another attempt or two. And if we don't do it uh, by then, we'll call it for the stream. Which isn't too bad because uh, somebody has decided to work on a stream schedule, so I'll be putting that up on uh, my Twitter starting tomorrow when I figure out a kind of like more weekly schedule. Because, you know, I'm trying to get the, the scheduling down just a smidge better. You know, it's like we figured out a time, now it's like figuring out days. In fact, depending on how things go, I might be streaming tomorrow around the same time. I thought you were going to finish this chapter. Yeah, no, sadly. So, um, the way that I usually work is I usually stream for about two, two and a half hours. Uh, just because of like the routine and the timing. So yeah, I don't do like specific game. Well actually, how much have I got of this chapter left, Cielo Girl, would you say? Like am I almost done with it or Is there still a bit to go? Cause I might help s yeah, I, prob I probably should instead of having like uh, anxiety. <laughs> You're good. Uh, hold on, aren't those like the face of the guests from the first game, from the kitchen, pure stuff in their face? At least that's what it looks like. Oh, so anxiety is great, but you know it was just great at lower implications. But what does it mean? So... Hmm... Well, it's no time to consider lore, because I think I'm going to get my ass handed to me again. What the fuck? Like, that's all I can really say about that. What the fuck? I'm getting it. Yeah, well, uh, I, I guess stealth section? Cool, uh, yeah. Stealth, just don't get caught. I don't like... Oh, is this roof guy? Oh, no, don't come over this way. Okay, well, it's a stealth session in this game. That means we just got to learn the timings and the patterns of when to go, where to go. Have you spotted me? No, you haven't spotted me. We're good. I'm going to guess Drift Guy is the one behind all the mannequins. Uh, if so, I'm going to be real with y'all. Uh, I'm really hoping we get to kill Drift Guy. Because Drift Guy deserves to fucking die for what he's put me through. I... Yeah, you're gonna... Yeah, please pick up that person and fuck off. Oh, boy. Just gonna move on. I'm noticing they're paying attention to the detail of them knocking lamps around. And it's like lamps, light, light is good and helps us. Um, we are going to have an unfun combination of roof guy and mannequins, aren't we? Oh, you don't tell me you spotted me. Uh, oh, I thought I could get under the bed to avoid roof guy. Um, I wasn't quite fast. Right, I need to... Mm, can Six just hoist him up to that button, I think?
Oh, hold on, where are you moving to now? Right, I think he's gonna hear us. Oh no, he's just here to say anyway. Um. Well, unlike Long Neck, uh, he's somewhat outrunnable. This part you're on is a bit hard if you want to call it here. Or are you gonna finish the hard part first? Um. A little past ten, yeah. Yeah, I'll give it one or two more attempts to see if I can figure it out here. This part you need. <laughs> ah, the thing that goes hand in hand with the the Onga man who's been an anxious wreck in this area. Over the bed, I what the <laughs> right. So I think I'm taking the wrong approach here, which means I'm hold on. Is that throwable objects way in the background? The piece you need is on the back. Oh, yeah, because I was looking at the throwable p pieces there, like the blocks and stuff, and it's like. Yeah, I'm gonna have to go all the way to the back, pick up something, and then bring it to the button. Oh no! Why am I not allowed to experience positive emotions in this area? Why? Why did Little Nightmares 2? Right. So I had the forest there. It was fun. It was neat. You know, we had the school wacky traps. So oh, you're gonna get bamboozled. Ah, oh, funny pranks. And then it, we get to the hospital, and like Little Nightmares 2 just like took a comedically large spoon, dipped it in, and it's like, open up, here's a spoonful feed and anxiety. What do you mean you spotted me from all the way over there? Um, I would need to like really keep in mind that. Oh, you've got some reach on you for a f stubby bastard. You know what, hold on. Let me try and observe this pattern more carefully. So he goes over there and has a look in that cabinet. Then he goes to the left and he checks like the body. I need to figure out when he gets like most distracted because oh right, right yeah actually yeah we so I'm gonna have to wait till he's distracted on one side and then go under the beds right he's currently at the right so we can Oh, I hate it because I can't even fully clearly see myself. So let's go to the right a wee bit more. And then I'm going to wait for you to move. He didn't spot me, did he? No, he's just moving around. Good, good, good. You saw nothing. I am fucking stealth, but I'm also a little bit, so I'm gonna wait for you to move around more. Um, is he gonna see me if I move from here? I don't know. I, I don't want to risk it. I, I'm actually gonna take the advice and uh, be patient, maybe to an overextending degree. Uh, and then I'll 
You'll take that body and then you'll move back to the right, I'm sure. Also, I'm sorry if this is like slow and I'm being too overly cautious, but like this game. This game has done things to me this stream. <laughs> it may not be fair to say, it might be a bit over dramatic, but uh, I, I think I've become a changed man after this stream. <laughs> You know, there was a guy who turned on the stream and started playing this game. He's gone. I'm a very different individual now. <laughs> Fucking Little Nightmares to Hospital. <laughs> and then I'm gonna go back under this bed because I, I don't want to get caught. I really don't. I want to be the smoothest moving motherfucker. I... The way he scuttled there, I... Thought he had spotted me for a second. This game really teaches you patience. Yeah, because I noticed that with some of the areas in the school, like the. If this game, you may have some. Maybe? And who knows, maybe that way polish up my fighting game techniques. You know, I'm gonna go into fighting games, people will be like, oh, unleashed how. How are you less hungry? How have you got more refined and polished to your nurture? And it's like, heh <laughs> heh, I, I played Little Nightmares too. <laughs> oh oh, it's go time. Open up fast gate. <laughs> Wait, no, climbing is a bad idea with this guy. Um. The fact that he spotted me, I'm wondering, am I just fucked? Because it does seem a lot of the time in this game that if you get spotted... Oh, so this is how you do your checkpoint. Interesting. But generous. I'm gonna have to move fast because he's gonna hear Mr. On the Toy. Yep, okay, I was right about that. I was kind of low-key hoping I would be wrong. Nope, that's not the answer, um... Do I need to go under the bed and hide so he doesn't even spot me? Hmm... <laughs> but yeah, no, the game definitely teaches patience because I noticed that at the... Specifically in the school, it's the area with the piano where you have to like do things only when she's like playing the music. Anyway, let's see if my idea of hiding is the right one. Because I don't imagine this guy's too smart. I mean, I say that when he's a doctor working in a hospital, he's probably actually quite clever, but um. I don't think he's a hide and seek champion. Yeah, when she's playing, yeah, yeah. That was an area that taught me patience, I can tell you somewhat. Oh, hi, Six. Nice to join me. Um, I don't like his face. Fat guy's face, just looking right at the camera, creeps me the fuck out. Not as much as the mannequins in the moving hand did, because they just came at me with actual bloodthirst. Now, which someone could say, but Unleashed, the mannequins don't actually have blood, so it's not really blood. I, 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 sh sh shut the fuck up. <laughs> I'm a scared wreck. I'm allowed to say whatever the fuck I want to about the mannequins and nobody can stop me. But yeah, I, I can definitely say this game, or... More so just this area has really given me the uh, the, the Halloween spirit. This is where the spooks were at. Where uh, I, I guess I need to thank Vitae for like inspiring me for- Oh no don't! Don't, don't touch those gaps. Um, but yeah I need, I need to thank Vitae for like encouraging me to scratch the little nightmares itch. 
Which I'm sure will be a fun no contest thing. People will be like, hey boss, thanks for the inspiration. I shot myself. <laughs> thanks. <laughs> I mean, the, the inspiration also came from the fact that this game was on sale for a big discount. Um, but, you know, I'm a, I'm a sucker for a bargain. Like, oh man, I'm violently shitting myself, but my wallet's intact! <laughs> oh, he's gonna hear that, isn't he? Or... No. I think this is near the end of the chapter if I remember. Hold on. Quarter past You know what? The terror is put me in a certain kind of mood. I'm, I'll, I'll stretch it like a, about 10, maybe 15 minutes longer than usual. You know, why not? We, we've had a, a, a good turnout this stream and I have been violently shitting myself. It says, Sex, what are you doing? Oh, hold on. This is good. Also, I just realised I've been separated from Six again, which means it's probably time to die horribly against mannequins and hands. I'm kind of getting a keen sense for when my life's in danger. No, we don't do dumpster diving. Oh, right, I guess we need to do more. No, I put... Honestly, I'll... I'll Okay, honestly, I'll take a, a puzzle. Like, I may be dumb, but I would appreciate just looking like an idiot rather than uh, shitting myself. It's like, you know what? I, I, y you know what? Maybe I've been hard on puzzles in my lifetime. Been like, ooh, I'm not a thinker. I can't use the, the thinking muscles working the brain. There's not, you know what? Puzzles are my friend, they were always looking out for me and they don't try to raise my heart rate and kill me. I, I love puzzles. Do you like but Hey, hey, do you all like puzzles? I love puzzles. <laughs> I'm a broken man, please send help. Don't be- I'm not- oh, Too late, I'm already being hard on myself. <laughs> I usually am. Uh... I mean, to be fair, it's like, you know, I'm getting outside of the comfort zone when I do puzzles and it's like, it's good to fucking get the cogs and the head turning every once in a while. Then again, I say that, but I've actually, in my own time, been playing um, The Great Ace Attorney recently because I do enjoy me Ace Attorney. Wait, hold on, I'm an idiot. I know what I have to do. It's platforming time, baby. Oh, and I see where the key is now. Oh man. Can we have more puzzles? I'm, I'm not done doing puzzling yet. <laughs> yeah, that, okay, see that was just like, you know, do a little pulling, do uh, a little platform. That, see, that's a puzzle I can get behind. That's easy shit. And it's also safe shit. I love it. I love my life not being in danger and terrified and uh. Uh, oh wait there's a cabinet there that's what we do for climbing The the fear's starting to wear off. I'm actually remembering to use my eyes again. It's it's great. I love my sight. Oh, 
my five senses are starting to like be out less unshaken and they've returned to me. But uh, I still push some incorrect ones from time to time. Six, there was no need for you to injure your legs and jump like that. But you know that's what true friendships all about. Right, hold on, I forgot how to climb. And never mind, I know I was just talking about my senses returning from fear, but uh Maybe I'm still suffering some mental damage, don't worry about it, I'm recovering. Mono, why don't you pull yourself up? I get it, Mono, the hospital it's scary, you don't wanna see what's gonna but fuck you next, but we need to move on if we're ever gonna get out of here. I'm not fucking staying in here forever. Cause fuck that. I'm gonna get out of here, I'm gonna like, look at those streets and I'm gonna kiss the dirt. The urban dirt, I don't care where it's been, I don't care who stepped in, I'm kissing that shit and feeling good. Oh, oh we, oh, I, Man, like I'm, re I'm gonna be so happy to leave this place behind. I, I love it for making me feel emotions of fear as a horror game. It's rare. Haven't felt this in a long time. Which it feels weird coming from Little Nightmares 2 of all things, but uh... Oh, hi you creepy bastard, you're back. You know what, you're the lesser of the three evils, I'll take it. Oh, you're playing with mannequins. God, don't tell me my prediction was right. Get a new fucking hobby, mate. Because your current one makes me violently shit myself and have mass anxiety. Which boss did I like so far? Um... So far? Um... I would say, I don't know, because Long Night was kind of creepy, but I want to say I liked the, was it the hunter, the guy with the gun first, because his death scene amused the fuck out of me. Oh no, there's a mannequin behind that curtain, I can see the slight movement. And I see there's a switch as well. Mm. But yeah, no, the, you know, just seeing, like, two small children, like, pick up a gun, fumble around, and, uh, you know, just shoot a guy. Like, that's, like, like there isn't a wacky situation, we just shot a man in cold blood. And that amused the fuck out of me. It was, you know, a better time, a simpler time. This part you got to think outside the box, um... Well, I've just killed somebody, I think. It's... Oh, you... Oh, you're just... Okay, you picked him up with a hand that you've got a saw on, okay. Oh, wait. No, the machine's back on. I need to deactivate it, right. Did I hide under the hospital bed? See, I'm trying to think. Did I just make a run for it as soon as he opens the door? Or did I hide under the hospital bed? Because I think I can get under that. You have to hide under the bed immediately after a shut down. Oh, so I gotta act fast with it. Move, Mono, move. Okay, well, I was able to figure it out. The confirmation helps. Oh, and then you're just gonna turn the power back on. So do I have to go now, do I wait it out? Yeah, I don't think he's moving, I think I need to... Just creep 
repair it. Or oh, he's doing, you know, whatever he's doing to that body. There's, yeah. Oh wait, I need to hurry. Wait, can I grab this one as well? No, it's just that one. Uh, oh, wait, I'm gonna do it. I see. I see now. Um, oh, TikTok is not gonna be distracted forever, I'm sure. Oh, wait, hold on. Is there uh, something here? Oh, battery. That's what that is. Yeah, he's not gonna hear me from here, so I'm gonna just hurry up. But he's gonna hear this opening ammo for a fact, so uh... Oh yeah, we got a chase sequence on our hands. <laughs> I'm gonna guess this is like, end of your game. Fucking hell, okay, he can just do that, understandable. Um, So I really got him out. I, I guess I just need to outrun it. Or do I have to like go back, climb over it and then run? No, I'm just gonna like it. Yeah, there's some cheeky brutal deaths in this game, Ska. Cause we've had like, in the school area before this, there's traps that trigger, um... Oh wait, hold on, I know what I need to do there, I need to like... Stop so I'm in the gap for that one landing. But yeah, in the school area you've got traps that trigger like... Lockers that fall and uh, buckets that like swing and smash your face in. So it's like, yeah, if there's one thing I can actually compliment Little Nightmares to over the first game, it's like the deaths are actually brutal in this game sometimes. Like, they will get crushed, brutalized. Like, ma, like, fucking Mono and Six go through it. I mean, like I said, the first uh, major enemy in the game is just a guy with a gun. Like, he has a whole ass shotgun. And says, you know, fuck these kids. Oh, no, uh, I need to, like, time my slide better. You're a bit too slow, you got act faster. Yeah. I think it's the slide bit that's thrown me off. I'm just, like, not doing it smooth enough. Because I'm, like, sliding and then having, like, a slight crawl. Afterwards, when I need to like perfectly slide under that shit. Oh no, I can't get over that, so I need to actually outrun it. Is there a slowdown on the slight rebound? Yeah, no, so it's got. I think the problem is, um, Basically, I go to slide, but I don't make it under the... If I time my slide wrong, I don't go under the thing perfectly. So it'll be like a sliding and crawl. And if I crawl like that, um, I'm gonna be slowed down. Yeah, no, I need to make that slide perfectly. Because if I end up, like, not going under it with the slide, then I crawl. I'm not going to be fast enough to outrun that. Because I'm like just a little behind. That's a mono, you throw that battery in rage. Right. Well, GG's, that's me absolutely dead, I'm sure. Unless. Oh, hold on. Oh, what do you mean I need to steer? Go, 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 go! Don't you fucking touch me! Oh my fucking god, he's actually using all the fat bastard energy to try and flatten me. 
I hope you die in this chase sequence, you fat cunt. Six, what are we doing? Oh, I thought I had to trigger some with six there. No, I just have to run. Oh, generous checkpoint, bro. Bless this fucking game with us. Oh, wait, no, I don't need to crawl under all that. I can stand up after, like, the first one or two. No, no, I'm still crawling. Oh. Uh, Go through the boat and then get out. Uh. Oh, go. Right, was that just like not going through the right bit there? Because I swear I could have like squeezed through that. And I think I see what the idea is, because if I get out the bottom there, he, we can like presumably trap him in there. Ah, just in time. <gasps> Is that a switch I see? Oh, cremate the bastard. Cremate him. Fucking vengeance. <laughs> oh, so I see unintentional savage. I love it, yeah. Well, let's warm up by a cozy fire. You know, I, I feel the comfort. Our guy burns alive in six. It's just like, yeah, you know, gonna warm my hands. Man, this game is making me love six. Like, she beats a kid to death with her broil. Exactly. <laughs> you know, gotta cook the, the meat just to perfection. How do you prefer your sex? Uh, medium rare or well done? Don't be shy, kiddo. I know you like consuming humans. <laughs> I've seen the first game. Yeah, but yeah, sex like... So sex helped shot a man, beats a child with their bare hands, and then just like, oh, toasty worm when we burn a guy alive. I love how savage she is. And the trophy and he was hospitalised. That's great. Um, so are we done? Do we just like exit the hospital now? I would love to be done with the hospital now we've killed a guy. I know it's just like, yeah, I'm kind of running over time a wee bit. Well, it's only a wee bit, it's not that bad. And now, hey, if ooh, I get through like a whole lot. If I get through the whole last chapter, that's actually a good thing. Oh, oh, beautiful. Oh, oh, mm, mm. The streets were safe. Oh, look, Scottish weather, rain. Oh, it's great. I love it. That should be the end of the chapter. Yeah. I just want to, like, run until I see, like, a safe state icon. Because I don't think I saw one leaving the hospital. I just want to be, like, extra sure. If you... Yeah, I think I'm going to end it here because that... Oh, God, that's a big, chunky stream. Um... So yeah, thanks everyone for coming and watching 
das actual anxiety fest. Um, eh, if you want to keep up with stuff, uh, you know, you'll see the links in my channel, YouTube for keeping up with archived and stream highlights, uh, Twitter for updates, but I will be now posting um, stream schedules on the weekly, so you'll be able to keep a eye on when I'm actually streaming, or when I'm planning to. Uh, as for the YouTube people who watch this in the future, um, so when are you going live next time? Um, I want to say maybe tomorrow, but I'm not 100% sure on that. If not tomorrow, it's going to be Tuesday then, um, but it's going to be one or the other. Because uh, Monday and Tuesday are quite good streams from a days from my streaming schedule, um, and it'll be around the same time, um, I always do it, uh, usually between, well, starting time is a bit, eh, it's usually about 7-ish, uh, in the Scotland time zone, uh, BST time zone, that start and go on to about 9, so that is, uh, when to expect it, um, so yeah, that's when to expect it. If you go on Twitter tomorrow, I will have a stream schedule up that I will tell you exactly when I'm streaming next week. Um, and as for the people who see this in the future on YouTube, uh, this was streamed live at uh, twitch.tv. Uh, and it, you know, c come see me have anxiety attacks and be a fumbling mess uh, <laughs> live in person. I think Chad, hey Chad, you want to tell YouTube how funny it was to see me shit myself live? <laughs> They, 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 they had a good time. I'm sure they had a good time laughing at my fear. It's great. We have fun here. Not me. I'm terrified. But we had fun regardless. Spooky season. Wacky. Anyway, I am going to end stream here. And enjoy a good breather away from horror game time. So thank you all for watching and I will see you next time.